Hi lads, welcome to my Foot 14 Eredivisie squad builder. Now we did one on my channel with the uh, Foot Ed, but this is the uh, console version for you. Uh, also along, we're doing a fitness team to make the full squad. Uh, we decided to go with a 4-1-2-1-2 this time. We did do a 4-2-3-1 on Foot Ed, but we've uh, changed it up. Uh, I always like to try, where possible, to build a fitness team to complement the first team. So you've got like a full squad builder instead of just... Basically, it's a team builder in it if it's not a squad builder. So, starting off with the fitness team, we've got Alvarado in nets from AZ Alkmaar. Uh, left back, we got Jetro Willems from PSV, solid player. Uh, first centre back, we've got Bruma from PSV. And next to Bruma, we've got Congolo from Feyenoord. And right back is Arias, uh, the Colombian right back from PSV. On to CDM, we've got Poulsen from Ajax. On to left midfield, we've got his Danish compatriot and teammate. We've got Victor Fischer. Next on right midfield is Bakali from PSV. Uh, next up Cam, we've got Willy Overtum of Isaiah Altmar. Still a quality player and still cheap. Now on to the strikers, we've got Luke Castanos from Twente. And finally, we've got Tim Matabs of PSV. Sadly, he's lost his five-star weak foot, but it's this year still a solid player. Now on to the first team. In nets, we've got Robin Bruiter from FC Utrecht. He's six foot five. Uh, his key stats is he's got 76 reflexes, 76 positioning, 75 handling. And for me, he's easily the best silver goalkeeper in the area division. He's the one you want in any silver team. On to left back, we've got Patrick Van Aanholt from Vitesse. Uh, he's on loan from Chelsea again this season. Uh, he's got 92 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, very pacey left back. Very decent. First centre back, we've got Karim Rikik from PSV. He's got medium attacking work rate, medium defence. Uh, he's got 85 jumping, 82 strength, 76 stand tackle, 75 acceleration. And for me, he is the best silver uh, centre back in the area division this year. Next centre back, we've got Matthias Jorgensen, also from PSV. He's got the medium attacking rate, but he's got the high defensive work rate. He's got 84 strength, he's got 75 speed and 74 heading. Uh, was a beast last year and he's a beast this year as well. Uh, on to right back, we've got Ricardo Van Rijn from Ajax. He's got the high attacking work rate, medium defensive work rate. He's got 87 acceleration, 86 sprint speed, 79 agility. Uh, another pacey fullback, both are excellent uh, going on forward as well. On to midfield at CDM, we've got Tony Bilhelner from Feyenoord. He's got a medium attacking work rate and a medium defensive work rate. He's also got the flair trait. So 84 ball control, 79 acceleration, 77 short pass, 77 vision and 75 aggression. Now on to left midfield, we've got Memphis Depe of PSV. He's got high attacking work rate, medium defensive. Four star weak foot, four star skills and he's got some good stats. 89 acceleration, 85 sprint speed, 85 shot power, 82 dribbling and 82 agility. Quality player, feels really good on the dribble. Just a tad expensive compared to uh, the others. Uh, on to right midfield, we've got Roy Behrens. He's, for me, the hidden gem of this team and the Silvers. He's got a five-star weak foot. He's got four-star skills, 86 agility, 84 acceleration, 83 balance, 78 dri dribbling. Uh, we found him better than Bakley, to be honest. And he's only 500 to 700 coins, roughly, on console. Uh, he's a definite bargain. He's a quality player. Now on to Cam. We've got Lassa Shawnee of Ajax. For me, the best option at Cam this year. He's got a medium attacking work rate, medium defensive work rate. He's got a four-star weak foot. He's got the finesse shot trait. He's got 81 ball control, 81 shot pass, 80 balance, 77 shot power. He's a great creator as well as a goal scorer. Pops up with some quite a few goals. Now onto the strikers. First up, we got Jurgen Lacardia of PSV. He's six foot three. He's got medium attacking work rate, medium defensive, four star weak foot, three star skills. He's got eighty two shot power, seventy nine finishing, seventy eight acceleration, and seventy six sprint speed. Uh, he's a general all round beast up top. And his partner is Sig Dawson of Ajax. Back to a silver this year from a gold. He's got high attacking work rate, medium defensive, 3 star skill, 3 star weak foot. He's got 80 shot power, 79 jumping, 79 strength, 77 finishing. He's got the power header trait as well. Uh, not the paciest striker, but they, they both have good shooting and are both good in the air. Uh, you can always apply the Hunter Chem card if you're feeling the 
pace a bit if you want to add a bit of pace and boost the shooting to be even more deadlier. Look at the pricing wise, roughly, this is a rough estimate because obviously the prices are fluctuating all the time. Uh, roughly Xbox looking at around 58k ish, 58,500. PS3 around 61k, PC around 76k. Quite pricey, but it is a very decent team. So now on to the online goals. We always use online matches to test the team. Uh, we're using online single matches. Now this, for me, this team can handle gold teams as in the single online matches, as you know, everyone's bronze benching to try and get the overalls down and we're going up against a lot of gold teams. So, so far this has been over my, this has been one of my most enjoyable silver teams in foot 14. We've got, uh, at the back we start off with the solid defence and we've got the great goalkeeper. So we were keeping quite a few clean sheets to be honest. Then we've got DP at the left midfield and especially Behrens at right midfield. He really is the star of the team. And uh, I think he's got to be one of the best hidden gems so far in foot 14 in silvers. Uh, especially for his price. Uh, five to seven hundred coins. He's absolutely insane. And coming up against him, people are not going to expect much. But he certainly did give opponents something to think about in the games. He was an absolute tank for me. Uh, so if you make an every division team, I suggest you really try Beeren's out. He's only cheap. Give him a go. Hopefully he'll uh, surprise you as much as he did me. Uh, only weaknesses in this team really was Vilhena at CDM. He, with his height, he could not win the headers. The defensive headers from goal kicks, I don't think he won one in the whole time I was using him. So you may want uh, to try Poulsen or even Danny Holler as a more defensive option. Because uh, Vilhena was quite lost a bit in the midfield. He, he didn't track back as much with his, with his only medium defensive work rate. And Sig Dawson and Lacardia up top both are great finishers. Uh, as I said, you can always use the Hunter card to imp help improve the pace if you're struggling there. But they are great finishers and really good in the air. Uh, Sig Dawson with his power header as well. <laughs>
So I hope you've enjoyed the squad builder. Uh, drop a like if you did enjoy it, and subscribe. And subscribe for more if you want some more squad builders. We're doing plenty of reviews as well. We just got a Totti review. Totti's an absolute animal, the long shot king. If you want to look at that one, uh, we're trying to build a channel up. So the more subscribers, the better. You're all welcome. I'm trying to do the best I can to get the best content out there. Uh, obviously we'll improve, we can only get better, so thanks a lot for watching lads, stay tuned, peace.